for trouble. Greetings, everyone. More this is Sour Caps, and welcome back from Morrowind. In the uh, last episode, we found the Lord's Mail, and also, I believe we murdered the Ordinator in that episode, too. And then between episodes, I went and dropped off a bunch of stuff, sold a bunch of stuff. And now we're here in Vivek to find Sweet Moon Sugar. Who's missing? Can you tell me anything about him? I don't trust you. Um, is there anyone I'm in Vivek? I'm waiting. Is there anyone in So maybe one of these okay. guys. Anytime you're ready, just don't keep me waiting. Okay. Do we have a friend? Veteran. Yeah, why not? South? South. Of course, I went the wrong way. Let's go down the right way. This is why I don't show going through a lot of Vivic a lot of times, because it's just pretty. You have to walk down some stairs, walk up some stairs. Sometimes I can hop up on the ledge and then jump down. But this should be a pretty good bet of finding somebody who likes this. You know, I've got enough ingredients to make more. Taking a shortcut, baby. Oh God, hurry, we only got a couple of seconds of this. Actually, do we need to go higher than that? I think it's just this one. Because only the four and quarter has three. Alright, some of you should like us. Yeah, there you go. Can you talk to me about what's his face? Welcome, friend. What about a random citizen on the street? Okay. Okay. How about now? Take a thousand dollars. Tell me about the boy. One of your kind over by the arena. Our arena is that way. I spent a thousand gold, I just made like... Ten thousand? I'm sure he's not gonna be caught up in here. Skull roll, thousand, ten thousand, no, fifty thousand. Yeah, that's what I thought. Pleasure is all. Why wouldn't you hide in the basement? Now look. What? Check the underworks in a minute, but <clears throat> I believe they did say canal works. So let's real quickly. I wish the arena was sort of a faction like it was in some of the old other games. Not now. I'm 
don't bother picking all of this stuff here. Let's start with the unlocked door. go there. But I don't remember if a while back we've seen some Morag Tong guild halls and I told you that was the guild of assassins. Legal assassins. And if you talk to one of their members they say you have to find the Grand Master. In the arena. Well, right where there. did I put that? Ah! Me, kind of terrible thing. Look out behind you. <clears throat> I don't need the poison. <clears throat> Steel longsword. I mean, I'm probably gonna take. Isn't this stuff worth selling? Yeah, it is. I don't need more money, though. But I wouldn't mind a full spare set. one right outside. You still with me? Let's try this one. Okay. We wanted a really safe route. Basically, just go through the sewers and swim out. Because the thing about... Also one in a four and a quarter. So we need to go that way. I think we can do it safer out here. The only punishment for uh, crossing a guard is having to fight him. You come? It's back to Rudderin. I'm saving a lot, not because I'm worried about running into the guards, more that I'm worried about this crashing. you go. Where'd you go? I'm gonna load. 
You're not supposed to just vanish. I just didn't turn around that time I thought he was gone. Those ordinators still pack a punch though. For as easy as we kill them. They won't boat me to anything, correct? Ahead. No, because that would just be too convenient. Okay. Escape was actually pretty underwhelming, except for. I will listen out, man. I think but make it quick. Teleport on me. Uh, Evan Hart, seven gold, worth it. All right, we're safe now. We're good. For all you to for, for all the boy, try to avoid the guards. I think we're home for three now. What say? So what's this regarding? You still there, boy? It is awesome. Thank you. Oh good, then we're free of this guy. off later. 
I'm sort of getting a collection of just cool stuff. Is there anything noteworthy I want to drop off? Yeah, one of these shields. Let's put it there. It's kind of got it's got the tribunal triangle, and that's kind of cool. That helmet's actually not bad. Does it reflect ten percent on self. Oh, it's in effect. Need that. Too. Put this back on. Sounds like it'd be cool. Um, you have attention. Are you here? So for an Albert Scott. Alright. Alright, so one downside to the house we picked is that there are often white storms outside. That's why I put the finally put the mark inside the house. So I don't need I'm to worry waiting. about the grand reveal anymore. Except for maybe at the end I'll show off all of our treasures. I shouldn't have pushed so hard. Let's just double check. So we've got the quest from the Fighters Guild leader <laughs> to kill all of all of the Thieves Guild. The other option you have. The only way to save this fighter's guilt from corruption of the Kamanatong is to get rid of Soaring Hardheart and those loyal to him. If you kill his chief supporters, I'll put my own life on the line and support you as Grandmaster. So we have to kill our first quest giver in Balmora. And then the orc that we haven't completed the quest for because he just wants us to go murder an innocent tax lady in Blade. So those are your options for becoming a Grandmaster. You either murder all of the Thieves' Guild, or you murder half of the fighters. And now we're going to go to Solder's Mora and see if we can find out about this missing blade, Chrysomir. That's so why we have Big Helendi here as an option. If she's one of the uh, minor supporters of the Thieves Guild, one of the minor bosses. And when I say well, you end up stranger. fighting the entirety of them, I won't speak of her, not out loud. We have a friend somewhere here. Oh. Yep, there it goes. Alright. I'm going to call this episode a little early. <coughs> if I'm not back in Sod with Mora, but I'm back in Alderoon between episodes, I might go up the out my inventory and sell out more crap. But hey, thanks for watching, everyone. Until next time, take it easy.